What's up, Nerds on the Renegade Cactus, but you can call me whatever you want. Welcome to another episode of The Assemble, this time with... A little out game. Called Lost Magic. Now, I'm pretty sure... Wait, I'm, I'm not sure which uh, of the screens we want. Uh, but we're, we can switch it on the fly. Now, Lost Magic, I do have fond memories of. I've bought this game back then at, at a GameStop. And they had, back then, they still had the seven days return policy where you could just... That's weird. That's weird. <laughs> you could uh, play a game uh, for seven days and return it full price, basically, or uh, rather swap it for a different game for the same price or, or below, of course. And I'm pretty sure I've played this game and I finished it on the seventh day and I was like, huh, I'm done. Now off to GameStop. They then changed it to three days and then I think, I'm not sure if they even have it anymore, but then they had one day return policy, but yeah. How pathetic. Do you think this is what the creator left to protect the world? Pathetic. No wonder humans are on the verge of being wiped out, as always, and rightly so. <laughs> sure. That's enough. Bishop of the White Knight, I will not allow any more of your selfish treachery. You always did make me laugh, Bishop of the White Knight. You even, even you cannot defeat me alone, now that I have obtained four of the wands. Why don't you just run off with your tail between your legs, while you still can? Do not underestimate me. I'm the keeper of the Wand of Light. Oh, he said that, um, well, it is my duty to protect the world and the hopes of its people. I see. So you bring that final hope to battle... You know what, let's switch it. To a battle you know you can't win. A grand final gesture that gets you off the hook? Ha! You talk about duty. You are simply diverting attention from what you should truly be doing. All under the cover of noble self-sacrifice. This is your best joke yet. Kneel before me. Cool. Poor miserable guardian of light. Praise my name. And I shall release you forever from the dreary shackles of the old world order. Never. Hey, and what an intro. I do not remember a single thing of this game. Touch the bottom screen and unleash attack magic. I mean, I... We're just... Wait. Okay, I, I can aim. Never taste my magic. I do remember the basic, the gist of it, or rather the mechanics, but story-wise, no idea. Oh, okay. dang. That's quite strong magic. I mean, she doesn't care, but that's quite strong magic. Why? Just having those wands allows her to suppress my power completely? How? Huh. You really don't know much, do you? I am the keeper of the wand of balance. I have the power to quell all other powers. Just what do you plan to do with that power? Diva of the twilight. <gasps> what is it you suffer from? What has brought you to such insanity? I will become a new creator. And then I shall bring a new order to this rotten, festering, filthy world of men. You are so bound up in the old world, I doubt you could ever understand my reasoning. I... We'll talk about that later. Destruction for the sake of creation? Is that what you think we need? <coughs> I'm sorry, Deep of the Twilight. I can't help you. Not anymore. Which means we have to settle this here and now. Yeah, let's do some more magic or whatever. Let's unleash magic. Oh damn, that's a... Dragon Phoenix something? Foolish man. The power of the creator who died so long ago is now mine. You think you can hurt me? I thought so. But now I don't. <laughs> Very well. As a sign of respect to your pitiful self-sacrifice, I'll allow you to aid me as my minion in the creation of my new world. You, a pawn of the old regime, 
will help me to destroy it and create a new. How delicious! Hey, Isaac! Oh, damn! That looks painful! Isaac, I'm sorry. I can only entrust the light of hope to you. You will never guess the name of the guy we are playing then. Oh, he did. He very, very did. You finally accepted your fate. Now hand over the wand. Mm -hmm. What? This wand is a fake. How dare you? But no matter. Your final act of defiance has amused me once again. A wand without a stage to protect it will not be hard to find. Your sacrifice has merely delayed the inevitable. Think on that, foolish sage of nothingness. <laughs> the end. <laughs> Chapter 1. Father's final message. You will never guess who we're playing. <laughs> Home of the forest witch, a small house tucked away in... I, I didn't press anything, the game did it. Memory of that day will live with me forever. What? Ink black clouds blotted out the sky as wave after wave of vile monsters ravaged our quiet town. People were thrown into chaos and panic, running for their lives. In all the destruction and confusion, I was separated from my mother and father. Overcome with fear, I fled deep into the old forest. I took no belongings, no food or drink. I ran until I could run no more, and finally, exhausted, I collapsed. <coughs> That's some Studio Ghibli <laughs> style. The old witch who lives in the heart of the forest found and saved me. She nursed me back to health, and once recovered, I became a pupil in the ways of magic. Although she can be a little severe at times, she treats me as her own grandchild. I mean, maybe she is your grandma and she ran away, I, who knows. But one day, something happened. I met my father again, out in the forest. I was filled with overwhelming joy at seeing him again, but something was different. He was see-through! Father, what's wrong? Please say something! Is it you? It is you, isn't it, father? Wait! Father, please! Father! What is this, Pokemon? The same dream again. Look at this, still sleeping. Time to leave your cot, child. Get that face washed. Yes, ma'am. After breakfast, we'll practice some basic magic again. So don't forget your staff. Father, what was it that you were trying to say? <laughs> what was it that you wanted to say but couldn't? He wanted to say, great deals down the market. No, I don't know. But maybe, I don't know. I haven't been to the market. Whoa. Okay, let's start with the basics. Have you got your wand? Yes. Yes, ma'am. Movement first. Touch your head and then touch where you want to go. Try opening that chest. Good, easy enough, isn't it? Hey, there's nothing inside. Master, that's not fair. What? what? Think you deserve a treat for walking? <laughs> ah! <laughs> you didn't expect to be rewarded for simply walking somewhere. Exactly! Like, did you, naive boy? Well then, let's practice some magic next. Hold down L and the rune drawing screen will appear. Try it, go on, press L. Okay, this is the main mechanic. And this is, in my opinion, quite interesting. It's the basis of it all. When you want to use magic, use L. It is through runes that mages call upon the power of mana. Keep holding down L until you finish drawing the rune, then release it. Drawing an accurate rune while holding down L is the key to successful magic. The neater and more accurate your rune is, the stronger your magic will be. But Take too long drawing a rune and you'll give monsters time to attack? Well, no one ever said using magic would be easy. Now, have you got all that? Yup. Yes, no problem. Good, good. Try it then. Hold down L and copy the fire rune from the top screen. Release L to finish. Boom, boom.
Good. That's the way. Once you have drawn your rune accurately enough, it's time to unleash some magic. Touch the place where you'd like to unleash your magic. Boom. Cool. A fireball. Good work. Well done. Now how about trying that in battle? I've got some monster dummies here for you to practice on. Defeat them with your magic. Wait, can I... Okay. No. Oh, I, I just skipped some dialogue, but I mean she just told me what to do. Can I walk with the D-pad? No. This is only... Okay, let's walk back. This is only to move the camera, so I really do have to run, or go, basically. Boom! <laughs> I, like, it's a little bit clunky, especially since I have to click on myself every single time I want to move. That is a bad rune of fire, but whatever. Wait, technically. Let's try something out. Uh, I know there are different runes. Okay. I mean, I don't know any of them. Damn it. I don't know any of them by heart, of course. Uh, it's been ages since I played this game. But I was just, like, thinking... Are they already, like, unlocked? Or do I have to unlock them before I can use them? And the answer seems to be... I have to unlock them before I can use them. But then again, I don't know how the runes look like. I completely do not remember. Very well, Isaac. Let's practice some other magic. Ooh. Okay, it's an S. This is the water rune. It allows you to freeze enemies in shards of ice. This is a light rune. Use the magic to heal your injuries. Uh -huh. I, th I think I can look, look them up somewhere, but good to know. Using a lot of magic in quick succession may cause your MP mana points to run out. If that happens, calm down for a moment and take a break. You'll find that the late mana power in the air will replenish your power. Well then, start training. Okay. So, we want to destroy all these monsters. Let's start with an S. Boom. And fire magic. And then we go away a little bit and we do some more uh, fire magic. And some more... Fire ma Whoa. Oh, I don't have the I don't have the mana to do that. So uh, let me through, please. Fire magic. An AOE fire magic would be nice. But whatever. Win. So I saw it on the other screen that it showed me what they look like, how many MP they cost, like the skills and the spells. I mean. Ooh, do I get more proficient the more I use them? I remember that I really, really liked this game, but just when I was done with it, I was completely done with it. I don't know if there's some, like, post-game stuff or whatever. So, yeah. Ball of fire, sure. Ice shot, ball of ice. And healing, but we didn't use the healing, so... But the healing was, like, so, 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 I think. Very well. I think that is enough for today, child. These three basic runes I have taught you are vital to all magic. Practice them well. I will. I will. After all, who can make progress without first understanding the basics? Very good. You are wise before your time. But still... Yes? I'd like you to teach me some more powerful magic too. So I... Th it's either that the more I use it, the stronger it gets, and then I get more spells in that direction, or I'll just have to earn them in different parts of the game. I'm not sure. Again, apart from drawing the magic, I don't really have any recollection of what we're doing here. Magic like I saw my father use. Now, Isaac, grasp, grasp the cooking pot too soon and you'll only burn your fingers. I mean, true? Power without control will bring disaster and unhappiness to those who wield it. But I'm ready! Sh shut up. Like, <laughs> all the 10 year olds in, in games like that, I'm ready! I will save the world! I will destroy everything! Like, screw you! You just hit a tree with, with, a, with, a, with a wooden sword! Like, but, but I can fight dragons now! No, you can't! Just shut up and sit down! <laughs> I want 
to catch up to my father so badly. I know my parents are alive somewhere. I need to be able to go and find them. Isaac, you have a good, kind heart. But shut up, but rushing to obtain power is a mistake. Such greed is trap only for the wicked. Promise me, your master, that you will bide your time. Understood? Yes, ma'am, I promise. Oh, bless me, I almost forgot. The head of Tamta village sent a request for some healish. Could you run over it? Over there? Could you run it over there? Oh, got it. No problem. Of course, no problem. I mean, if magic were real, I would practice the hell out of basics. I know you can do that with, with real life application as well, just practicing the basics over and over, and that's mostly boring. So if magic was real, it would probably get boring over time as well. But it's just magic, throwing fireballs, freezing stuff. I love ice magic, or whatever. Time ties to the west, remember, don't get go getting lost in the forest. Go straight there and come straight back, you hear me? Yes ma'am, see you later. And we're gonna go to... Okay, we, we probably have to... Yeah, this is probably it. Nope, that's Windmill Plains. Forest, forest, almost forest switch. I mean, we, we, we have to go through the forest, it seems so... Let's just go. Rumbling. Whoa, is that thunder? Quick, Parakeru, let's go. Who? Who or what is Parakeru? Oh, we got a little bird now. Keru, 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 What? Sound of magic lightning? No one could be using magic so high up, Parakeru. You can be so odd sometimes. Arr, what? Hey, no need to get upset. Oh no, it wasn't a bird. Oh. That's an Orcus? Oh, an Orcus? What are monsters doing here? Parakeru, get into my bag. Quickly, hide. We, we got a little, like, companion just because. <laughs> I think my magic is enough to deal with a mere Orcus. All right, let's sh freeze him, shoot some fireballs, stuff like that, you know, the usual. Now, what? What is it now, Parakeru? I was just about to start fighting. What? Check my status? I know how to do that. Just touch my own head, right? The blue bar in the top left is HP. If that runs out, we'll weaken and lose battle. The yellow bar is MP if it runs out. Yada yada yada. Really? Touching enemies in the same way will show me their status too? Show me your status. <laughs> Interesting. I'll give it a try. Thanks. Okay. Okay. Um... First of all, we walk over here, then we do this, boom, we freeze you, run away a little bit, a little bit of fire, that was just the smallest of fireballs. Alright, we're gonna do this, shoot, we're gonna do this, this, something like that, heal ourselves. Okay, okay, let's see. Can I hit this? Oh, okay. It's just a regular S, it shouldn't be that hard. I'm gonna keep shooting with the ice just because uh, we already. Oops. We already uh, did some fire. Oh, we didn't. We don't have enough MP. Oops. Leave me alone. Leave me alone, I didn't do that. And by that I mean, haha, you did. <laughs> okay, we're gonna wait a little bit. Go in with some healing magic that was really badly drawn. As I keep saying, like, it's... It should be quite easy on... Uh, with mouse. Uh, like, with the mouse. But... Oh, well. Totally with that. But it is way easier with the stylus. Okay, three monsters left to go. We're gonna start with the Orcus, I think, because, I mean, the mushrooms are probably way easier. Also, let's shoot some fire again. Go here. That was a bad fireball. Whatever. We're gonna wait a little bit, just for the MP to come back. I love that these mushrooms are just running around and not doing shit. Okay, that was a bad one. 
That was an even worse one, but somehow that the game took. Like, yeah, sure, that's that's an S. That's enough of an S. <laughs> Alright, that was decent EXP. And yeah, look, it went way more towards water now. He liked. Okay, so that's just because we used it now, we know what it is. That's stupid, but okay. Ha! Take that! Taste my ice balls! <laughs> Still, it's strange to encounter monsters here. In fact, it's the first time I've ever seen them this deep in the forest. Hey, the thunder seems to have stopped too. So I was just imagining it. Or it just was there and now it's not anymore. Like, is that such a hard concept? Tamta Village. Ooh, I like that bear. <laughs> At last, I made it. Chief, are you home? Hello? Who's there? Oh, hello Isaac. Good to see you. Hello. Grandma told me to bring this healish to you. Thanks. I know I've asked a lot of your grandma, but thanks to her magic healish, my little Natsu is almost fully recovered. When she was infected by that monster poison, I prepared myself for the worst. I can't thank you and your grandma enough for this. No problem. Grandma always makes delicious stew from the game you give us. Without the hunting skills, we'd be eating roots and leaves every night. Don't worry, it all balances out. Yeah, I've got your head screwed on right, young man. Perhaps we have your grandma to thank for that too? Well, I guess so. She knows her stuff, but she's pretty strict. You can't afford to slack off around someone who can actually make lightning strike. No, and I must be patient. I need to become strong and strong enough to go and search for my parents. Of course, that's right. I hope you are able to find them soon, Isaac. Who's there? Boss, we've got trouble. What's the matter, man? Take a deep breath. Calm down. Monsters, we've been attacked again. The timber company has lost more men. Curse those wild beasts. We'll never get the road restored. If they carry on like this, it's hopeless. This sounds like a job for me. More like a grandma, but okay. Magic is the best weapon to defeat monsters, after all. Isaac, wait! Be careful, you hear? I'll be right there with as many men as I can find. One, two, we're off! <laughs> Alright, let's go destroy some monsters with our magic. Okay, where are they? Up there, there's one. Boom, get frozen. Oh, we froze. Okay, so there is a chance to freeze them, it seems. Whoa. Is there a chance, wow, with the fireball to burn them is the question. Boom. Freeze them. That was a bad one. Uh, we don't have the mana to do that shit. I really need to look at my mana way more. Okay, we wait a little bit. We heal. Oops. Okay. It lags a little bit behind. Like, I start drawing and I'm not sure if I... I'm sorry for all the flashing screens. It's just... Again, I... What did I do now? Why did I do that? <laughs> it's not that hard, I promise. You press L, you, pay, you draw. And then you let go of L in order to use the attack or the healing now the thing is like I said sometimes it doesn't show up right away that you actually that was bad you actually draw something so that's why that's what throws me for a loop okay this guy we're gonna destroy with fireballs again oh that was a good one I would love to just click somewhere and run, instead of having to click at myself and then make myself run there. Boom. Bam. But yeah, I, re I remember, like, if... Who are you? If you get the hang of it, it's, it's really easy to shoot a lot of uh, magic pretty fast. Clap, clap, clap. <laughs> Impressive. You've got some real skills there, boy. You must have quite a master. Who's there? Do excuse me. My name is Leonard. I'm a student of magic, just like you. Leonard? You're a mage? That's right. You have potential. Instinct. If you trade well, I can see you'll be a powerful mage. Really? Of course. 
But when battling monsters, magic will only help you so much. It is not without limits. Magic has limits? I mean, yeah. <laughs> you haven't felt them? Yet, think, mages are only human. You might be able to withstand a hit from an orcus, but anything bigger will cut you in half. No matter how much you practice, the fangs of a dragon will still tear you apart, right? Well, you're right, but I don't like how that sounds. What did you think? That you shoot a single fireball and the dragon is like, ah? <laughs> Fear not, for you can turn the power of monsters to your own advantage. After all, monsters- what? Were created by humans, I guess? What? Humans created monsters? Well, you don't need to hear about that right now. Now then, just follow my lead. Uh, okay. Oh, before I forget, first let me give you this rune. Oh? It's a dark rune. It has the power to capture monsters. Weakening a monster first makes it easier to capture. Now, draw the rune and capture a monster. So it's basically... Okay, it has to be pretty much right next to me. Oh, wow! That's it, very good. Once you have captured some monsters, you can use them to form your very own battalion. Awesome, I don't remember that one bit. My own battalion of monsters? That's right. You can use a lineup screen to line up monsters to your unit point limit. As your level increases, so too will your UP, allowing you to deploy a stronger force. Understand? Yep. Yeah, I get it. Stronger monsters require more unit points, so line them up carefully. I'm sure you're up to the task anyway. Now then, I'll show you how to command your monsters in battle. Oh no, more buttons to press. We did it! I totally forgot that there was the, this monster capturing business. I just remembered this. And I would guess, like... Since it goes towards the uh, the elements, I would guess if it hits this, we learn a new spell, and if it hits this, we learn a new spell, maybe. Or maybe this is just for show, I don't know. This is just me thinking out loud. Trap, seize monsters, touch the ground to set a trap, best to weak monsters first. Touch the ground to set trap. Oh, and if they run over it, then they, okay. <coughs> gotcha, gotcha. Now you've captured some monsters, let's try commanding them in to help you out. I guess? But if I've got powerful magic of my own, I won't need monsters to help out, will I? You're quite a bold one now, aren't you? But you're wrong. Monsters are vital for protecting and for inflicting more damage in battle. You're still not quite convincing me. Meat shields! Every mage needs a meat shield! Sorry, I hit the microphone. Every mage needs a tank, usually. That's why in, like, World of Warcraft you can, uh summon elementals. That's why in other games you can summon elementals. That's why in this game you can uh, capture monsters and let them fight for you because you need meat shields! It's the easiest the easiest part of being a mage. Just get someone else to take the damage. <laughs> Still not quite... Oh, wait, whatever. Then try it out and see for yourself. You'll come around. First touch that monster in front of you. Then get it to open that chest over there. You! Open up! Oh my goodness. So many different things to do in this game. There you go. Easy enough, huh? You can also tell a group of monsters what to do with one simple command. You can use the stylus to draw circles on the screen. Draw one around a group of monsters. Oh! Got it. What's next? Now you can tell all those monsters at once what you want them to do. Use this moving when moving on mass, when launching concentrated attacks and for protection. Huh, how timely. Leave your monsters and fight off these enemies. Murder! Murder! Keep... Keep murdering! I, it, just keep doing it! Yeah, thank you. I mean, they, they just... With the first one, they just stood there and were like... Now what? Enemy moved away, now what? Yay! They hit the little mushroom guys. I like the little mushroom guys. Oh, I want to capture them as well. They are probably very useless. Because so far they haven't done anything. Like, they, they came at me menacingly and then did a little bit of damage every now and then. Yeah! Clobber them! Clobber them! I mean, I could have done this in, like, one attack or two. I get it, but... We have meat shields now. 
That wasn't the last of them. From the looks of things, finish the job. If one of your monsters is defeated, it will return to your wand. You can call it out in next battle, sure. But the current battle will be tougher. You can equip monsters with items to cover their weaknesses. Try to keep them alive. Do you think you can handle all this? Sure, no problem. Go on then. I don't remember this being this um, deep, basically. I thought, wait, can I still do stuff? Yeah, okay. I only remember it being a short game with like a fun draw the magic attacks kind of thing. Okay. Boom. Where are my guys? Over here. You attack this. You go over here. You know what? Let's let's heal ourselves. Can I heal my own uh, my monsters? I gotta try that out. Oh, missed. I'm gonna go and try that out right after destroying this little mushroom fella over here. I hit. I hit again. And you know what? I hit again. Now, can I heal? Also, can I trap one of the mushroom guys? Yes, I can heal them. Oh, that's cool. That helps me. Okay, wait. Um, it's a... Like this? I can set a trap? I can shoot this? Oh, damn it. Um, let's try this again. Oh, that's bad. Okay, not strong enough. Um, okay, I know I'm about to die, ha! but I just wanted to get that little mushroom fella, just to have it. Uh, you guys go over here now for a second, I wait till I can heal myself. This seems like it could be very, very hectic later on. Yeah, murder him! With fire! <laughs> I helped! Okay, this is interesting. This is way more interesting than I remember it. At my Orcus's level up. Weird. I like that. Life bracelet. You found an item. A bracelet said to have been worn by all by a four-horned albino albino dog. Raises max HP. Uh, add to the item list. Da! I love it. I love it. It's a misty mush. This mushroom will unleash a nasty attack at close range. Okay, we have to check out the stats later on. Because Orcuses, I would guess, are stronger than the mushrooms, right? Ew, finally saw them off. I thought I was in, in real trouble for a moment there, but thanks to you... <gasps> Where is he? Huh? He's gone. Leonard, I guess he likes his privacy. Isaac, are you okay? Yeah, no problem. Just like I said, I saw those monsters off. Wow, amazing. But then your grandma is your biggest influence, so it's no surprise. That's right. Still, the roads heading north and west have been badly damaged by monster attacks, and they continue to prevent us from making any progress. We've barely made any repairs yet. Here's hoping things will improve from here, although I fear it'll only get worse. All right, let's check out the main the lineup and see if we can compare units here. Orcus 377 and 72 attack. 430 and 80 attack. This one is way stronger, it just has less uh, defense. Oh, unit points we got uh, 2 out of 3, so we cannot use the Misty Mush here. Because we don't have enough. We need one more level up, I guess, or two more level ups, or we need some level ups in order to increase our unit points. Let's save for a second, and that is a really bad looking red. <laughs> okay, I wanna go and see if we can uh, fight once again before going back to Grandma, because we are already 34 minutes in. Hey! What's that? Something is falling from the sky? Whoa! Ouch. Oh, I'm sorry, are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, I guess I'm okay. 
what about you? I've never seen a big girl fall from the sky before. I'm sorry about that. There's a reason, of course. You see, I'm the wind. Well, anyway, no matter. In fact, I'm glad I bumped into you. Would you lend me that wand? I don't think so. No, sorry. I can't let you lend you this wand. I it from my father. It's very important to me. That's always telling me that a wand gives a mage life. Ah, not very charitable, are you? Looks like we've got company too. Monsters? Don't worry, leave them to me. You? Are you sure about this? Well, actually, I'm not that confident. I'll give you this rune, just be safe. Wind rune? Ah! With this you can fire wind magic at a great distance. Try not to get hurt badly. Sure! The loading times are interesting. Start. Oh, um, so it was a C, basically. Boom. Oh, nice. There was another C here, basically. And by the way, a C. Uh, you? What about you? Okay. We're gonna go here. We're gonna heal my fellas in order to train some light magic. Uh, we're gonna do some frost magic, of course. Fire some fire magic. I didn't have enough MP for that. So we're gonna wait. And... <laughs> we're just gonna be support healer now. Boom! Get healed. By the power of support healer. I mean, healers are usually support, right? That was a bad wind rune, but it works. I don't have enough MP. Again. Okay. But now I do, and I can heal my friend, underling, minion. Okay. Uh, we're gonna fire. I should have also gone for. Damn it. Uh, wrong direction. Also, not enough mana. Damn it. Wait. Can I hit you? The answer is no. But I should have I should have used some some ice magic because that has a chance to freeze which would have gotten rid of at least one of the enemies. But well, we won anyway. We lost one of our orcuses, but the next fight they are back in. At least that's what the game told me. Damn, that's a lot of experience. Survival 66.66%. .66%. Our healing gets increased quite a bit because you can't just let your monsters do the do the talking, basically. And you stand back and heal them. Although that's a bit boring over time. Alright, victory! Well, you certainly surprised me. You're pretty strong. Well, I guess. By the way, yes? What's with that wand? What? That wand? Didn't you want mine a minute ago? What? Oh, this cheap thing? No one could fight with this. Your wand is pretty powerful though, isn't it? And your magic is pretty powerful too, for a child. A child? You must have a pretty amazing master. Who teaches you? My grandma teaches me. I live with her in the forest up ahead. Could it be? The sage of the wet wood forest? The sage? Uh, anyway, I'm Trista. I'm learning magic too. Do you think you could take me to meet your grandma? Would that be okay? Uh, I need to ask her first. Not without asking her first. Forest can be dangerous, you know? I'm not sure I'd be able to protect you if we ran into some monsters. It might be better off taking shelter somewhere. There's a village very close by. Well, that's very kind of you. But don't worry, I'll be fine. I can look after myself, no problem. Are you sure? You look kind of weak to me. Yes, I'm sure. Weak or not, the very order of the world itself rests... Rests on what? I don't think I haven't noticed all the weird things you've been saying. He acknowledges it! He acknowledges it! I mean, he doesn't really cry anymore about I am the wind, <laughs> but he acknowledges it, I liked it. Oh, it's nothing, let's get going, lead the way. All right, and with that, we're gonna see, can we change the lineup a little bit? Do we have enough? No, we don't. But we can uh, give the life bracelet to the orcuses. Would it be better to switch to the mushroom fellas so that they gain some experience? I don't know. Anyway, like I said, this game is intriguing. I remember why I liked it back then. 
I think I might keep playing either on my own or maybe on the channel in the future. But I've said that for a few games, right? So we'll see. Anyway, thank you nerds so much for watching. I'm the Renegade Cactus Knight. Gotta run. Bye bye.